Good day. How are you all? Today we are going to talk about mean and standard deviation of a binomial distribution. So I will share my screen with you. It says the probability is 0 0.02 that a bike produced in a factory is defective. 10,000 bikes are produced in a month. Find the expected value and the standard deviation of defective bikes. Okay. So again, uh, we have to realize that this is a binomial distribution problem. Distribution problem. Because two possible results, two outcomes. One is defective and two is not defective. Okay. So the mean of a binomial distribution distribution is mu x is equal to n times p where n is equal to number of trials and p is equal to probability of success. Here success is to find defective by here success is to find is to find a defective bike defective bike so don't leave right away because i'll give you a hint or a easy way to do this problem at the end Okay, so my n is number of trials is equal to 10,000 here. And my probability of success, small p, uh, is 0 0.02. That is probability of finding a defective bike. Okay, so mu x is n times p is 10,000 times 0 0.02 so that is equal to 10,000 times 0 0.02 or 200 so the mean of this binomial distribution is 200 what does this mean out of 10,000 bikes produced on the average two will be defect two hundred will be defect will be defective okay now let's create some space so that's the mean what about the variance so No, variance of a binomial distribution of a binomial distribution is sigma x square is equal to n times p times q. So my tip or hint is uh, q. Yes, yeah, sorry, q, sorry. Here, let me erase these things so that there is no. Okay, so if I'm back here, binomial. Oops.
Q is the probability of failure. Or equal to 1 minus P, where P is the probability of success, where P is the probability of the success. Probability of success. Probability of success. Therefore, sigma square is equal to n times p times 1 minus p. In this case, it is 10,000 is n multiplied by p is 0 0.02 multiplied by 1 minus 0 0.02. Now, we already know, so sigma square, 10,000 points times 0 0.02 is 200 times 1 minus 0 0.02 is 0 0.98. So that will be equal to 200 times 0 0.98 or 196. Now that is the variance. So to find the standard deviation, we have to take the square root of the variance. Standard deviation. Is square root of variance. Is square root of, in this case, 196. So in our calculator, we can press second button, then x square, which gives me the square root. Inside the square root, I type 196 and enter. So sigma, which is the standard deviation. Is equal to second x square gives me the square root. And then 196 should be 14. So that's your standard deviation. And your mean we already calculated is 200. Okay. So what is standard deviation? Is uh, an average deviation of number of defectives, cycles, bicycles, bikes from the mean. Okay. Remember, uh, we our mean is... Uh, 200. So on the average, the mean is, uh, we found out earlier, is 200. So if you do 200, mu minus sigma is 200 minus 14 is 186. And a mu plus sigma is 200 plus 14. is 214. What does it mean? On the average, out of 10,000 bikes produced, bikes produced anywhere from 186 to 214 bikes will be defective. Will be defective. So that is my uh, tip. That That is the interpretation of the standard deviation. It's an average deviation of the number from the mean. So anywhere from 200 minus 14 is 186 and 200 plus 14 is 214. So on the average out of 10,000 bikes produced, anywhere from 186 to 214 will be defective. Okay. So I will stop here today. If you have any question, comment, write me a note. I'll get back to you. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. And you and your friends, please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. You know me, I'll be back next time with another interesting problem, interesting solution. So do not forget to tune in next time.
to watch another solution to another interesting problem. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a nice day. See you next time.